So we're going to take two videos of this piano, one at night and one during the day to get the best lighting because of all the damage that we found on this piano. So we're going to start with the bench has a lot of, there's Nick, Chip's Nick's, then over here. You can see all these chips and nicks out of the bench alone. We've got a nice big divot chip out of the bench there. Now, with this closed, you see there's significant damage here. We're just going to go along the piano looking. Okay, as you see, you come down here. There's significant nicks and like there's like a whole chunk of wood missing out of here. Nicked and scratched all the way up. Giant naking divot. Okay. We're going around, around the piano. We come over to the side. This is the lid. You can start to see right here. Damage, damage, damage all on the lid. Okay, that's down one side of the lid. There's damage down here on the back of the lid. Then, I haven't even gotten to the other side of the lid yet. As you can see, this huge thing here, this huge outline, that is water damage on the top of this finish. This finish should look like this. It should look shiny. There's even a giant scratch through it, you can see. But it should look shiny. It should not look dull and crackled like this. That is water damage all across the top of the piano. So then we'll come around to the other side. We've got damage right here that looks like somebody tried to paint over it and color it. We come around this side looks like that side is okay now get back here we've got damage right here we've got damage right here so that's two spots already down this side of the piano there's a significant scratch down the side of the piano uh, if I start to raise this up raise up the keyboard We'll see there is it is absolutely filthy disgusting look at that I mean this whole thing is just covered in dirt and filth there's scratching if we go along here we've got huge divot huge divot huge divot okay still going along the edge of the keyboard here as you can see it's just covered in filth Look at this, just filth and dirt everywhere. This entire keyboard is just filthy dirty like this. Okay. So then we're gonna go along, that was the lid. Now we're gonna go along the more of the bottom here. And you're gonna see as I go along the bottom, we've got significant chips right here we've got somebody tried to like repair a giant gouge out of it we've got lots of so you can see chip chip giant gouge somebody attempted to repair and did a very poor job of it then you come down here and you've got gouge 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 and that's what it looks like you've got right here where somebody again tried to repair damage and did a very poor job of it you've got now if i start to just damage across the lid again right there just like pretty much everywhere on this piano now on the side there are all these little, tiny little divots. 
kind of hard to see, which is like water damage, like something ate through the finish. All these tiny little spots you see here, something literally ate through the finish on the top of this piano. I think I'll go down before I lift the lid. Okay, so these are the casters. The wheels, they are completely corroded. A regular caster should be like shiny brass. As you can see, these casters are all completely corroded. I've got corrosion on this one too, right? You look, there's damage all along the legs of the pianos as well. Um, I'll see if I can get better shots of those in the light, in the daylight. But like, for example, here's a nice big divot out of this leg here. And then there's a bunch of, but let me see if I can get this, a bunch of divots out of the side of the leg here. That's damage, damage all the way up. Then, probably need to get a flashlight in under here for this because this is like a rusted, disgusting mess underneath there. If I come back around to this leg, you can see there's water damage. There's there's damage right there, damage all up this piano. Okay, now if I lift the lid. Let me just set this down and lift the lid fully. Then I'm gonna take I'm actually gonna take the uh, the music board off so that you can fully see inside the piano. The music board slides off so technicians can do their job. You can see that there is straight up cat hair. This thing is so filthy. I mean, the pins are starting to rust. You can see all the rust from the pins. You can see the rust from the screws. You can see like there is so much animal hair in here and so much dirt and filth and rust that I mean there's just at the, I mean look at the look at all this cat hair, cat hair everywhere. And what the piano movers said to us was that part of the reason why those casters, those wheels, you can see like the strings have started to tarnish. There's just filth completely under there on the board. Like what even is that? I don't even know. I always wash my hands after I touch this thing because I have no idea where it's been or what's happened. You can see like the level of dust that is on these hammers like this hammer should be you can see that level of filth that's in this piano and level of rust and i mean like what is this something spilled all over it it's just insane the level of filth and dirt and tarnish on this piano that is supposedly, let me go get a flashlight. Take a walk with me and I'll get a flashlight real quick. Let's see. Cooking some leather. Let me turn those down. Okay. Turning down my cooking. All right. So, because you got to see the pedals. So I'm gonna get this. You can just see like the level of let's try to get some light in there. The level of filth down in there and tarnish. I mean it's foul. I mean that is that is so gross. I mean what it, what even is that? Did a cat pee in the piano? Like we don't even know. So then you come down here. You can see, see all those spots? That's rust straight up down the pedals. 
the pedal bars are straight up rusted. Rusted. Let's see if I get this going like this. This flashlight's just really bright. But that's straight up rust, right? Just, it's rusted. All those little spots are rust. You can see down here, like it's even cracking and breaking the seals and the rust. The pedals themselves are completely like tarnished. Oh, there's a little bit of damage too. I see that in the wood. So this apparently is what this seller considers pristine, not a scratch on the walnut finish and barely used. That is what this guy says about this. And you can see there's the serial number.